the Metro Blue Line will undergo a $1.2 billion overhaul starting in January. That means the Blue Line will be shut down for the first eight months of 2019. Annenberg Media's Max Goldwasser shows us the changes that will affect Metro riders. The Blue Line is the Metro's oldest and most heavily used line. According to Curb Los Angeles, around 70,000 people ride the Blue Line every day. But some of those people are not pleased the Blue Line is closing for eight months. It's a terrible idea. Uh, a lot of people use it to go to work. It's gonna, there's going to be a lot more congestion. It means I'm going to have to find a different way of getting to work. It's really the only way I could get to work unless I take the bus or like take an Uber. So the Blue Line won't be closed altogether for those eight months. The repairs will actually be split into two phases. Now if we take a look at the map, I can show you that in the first phase from January through April, there will be no service from the Willowbrook station to the Long Beach station. Then starting in May, Metro will shut down the stretch from the Willowbrook station to right here in downtown LA. Metro communications manager Jose Ubaldo says there will be a replacement bus service to accommodate those affected. Ubaldo also says among the renovations will be new Metro cars and new power lines. They're probably not going to notice anything big, but the major thing they will feel and will see it's a better travel time from downtown Long Beach to downtown Los Angeles. This marks the first time the Blue Line will be closed since it opened 28 years ago. The line is set to reopen in September 2019. For Annenberg Media, I'm Max Goldwasser.